Hi everyone. If you've ever tried building a robust quest system in Unreal Engine 5, you know how challenging it can be. Dealing with data management, object communication, and prevent weird bugs can be a real headache. Well, I've been there, and I've built a comprehensive solution for it. A modular and highly flexible quest system designed especially for Unreal Engine 5. This quest system isn't just advanced and lightweight, it's also designed to be so easy that even game designers can use it without getting bogged down in the complex code. The best part? It's open source. I've uploaded the entire project to GitHub and you can find the download link in the description below. Let's dive into some of its core features. Modular component based structure. The system is built on top of two main components. The quest component and the inventory component. They are both attached to the player controller, making it super easy to manage all your quest data. I've also added a simple quest interface to the player controller for quick access and data abstraction. Flexible quest timers and conditions. Need dynamic quests. For example, a quest that fails if the player doesn't complete it within a specific time frame. My system handles it effortlessly. Think of a cross the bridge quest that it fails if the player takes it too long to cross the bridge. How cool is that for creating tension in your game? Managing quest status with the status changed function. Our system has a powerful function called status changed. This allows you to dynamically change the gameplay behavior based on the quest new status. You can override this function in your blueprints to do anything you want, like opening a door or triggering a specific dialogue when a quest fails. Power of conditions. This is one of the most powerful parts of the system, using conditions. You can define complex criteria that determines if a quest is completed or failed. For example, you can set a condition that requires the player to collect 10 specific items. This entire system works with blueprints, so you don't need to worry about C++ at all. Seamless integration with inventory component. Another major strength is a strong yet very lightweight link between inventory and quest components. This connection is built around the gameplay item data data asset, which is simple and highly flexible data structure. This design makes working with items like collecting them or using them in quest conditions fast and visual. You can easily inherit from that data set to create your own custom data structures. 4. Complete flexibility in quest design. The system is so flexible and you can update quests in a lot of different ways. For instance, you can assign new quests directly from level blueprint at the beginning of the level, or you can use a quest trigger box in your level to manually change the quest status uh, or change it inside another quest's new status update. The quest system design is inspired by Unreal Engine's GAS framework, preventing unnecessary behaviors from existing which helps you avoid bugs or issues. Ultimately, this quest system is perfect for any project, from small indie games to larger titles. It's advanced, yet lightweight and incredibly flexible. I hope this system helps you bring your game ideas to life faster. And remember, the GitHub link is in the video's description. Go ahead and clone the project, and if you liked it, please give it a star. Feel free to ask any question in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, a like and subscribe would be greatly appreciated. See you in the next one.